What's up guys, we just walked out of the Disney and Pixar Studio Showcase where they showed off a ton of new content coming to your screens. We're gonna talk about our favorites, but first we need to talk about what your favorite is and what's going on on the site, Joshua. Well, it, it, the clear fan favorite on the website right now is Mufasa the Lion King, which is a prequel yep. telling the origin of Mufasa, which I did not realize he just like wasn't just like made king in, in the next in line. Apparently he was an orphan and went through a lot of trials and tribulations where so he eventually became the king that we know, uh, which I thought was re really interesting. And we yeah. saw some footage. What did you guys think of that? I mean, if you've seen the first Lion King, you've kind of seen what it looks like. Right, it's that live action yeah. style. Live action, as in it's animated, yes. but it is live. Very good. Yes. <laughs> well, they don't really use real lions because they can't. But John Favreau, of course, directed the first one. Barry Jenkins is directing the new one. But uh, yeah, it was a quick teaser. It looked exactly the same as the original Lion King from 2019. And, we uh, saw Mufasa just as a young cub. He gets washed away in a river. You know, he is an orphan. He's, yeah. I guess that's how he loses his family. Uh, the story is being told from the present day. It seems like by Timon and Pumbaa, who and are desperate Rafiki. to be in the sequel yes. of the movie. <laughs> that seems to be the joke. And if I know a lot of criticism uh, from the first movie was that you couldn't get a lot of real emotion because they are trying to replicate real animals. And yep, when he was like running down that river. I wasn't seeing much fear or happiness or anything. No. I, just, I love the I love the comparison online where it's like, all right, so here's uh, the Lion King, like the animated, and it's like Simba, like, oh my God, I'm about to be trampled. And then it shows a comparison to the live action movie and it's just a lion. Uh, now let's talk about some of our favorites that we yes. saw coming out of this. Jeffrey, what was the favorite thing you saw? My favorite thing that I saw out of the Disney and Pixar Studio Showcase was Elemental. Oh. That's right, I'm gonna hold this the rest of the video. So <laughs> Elemental. Elemental. Oh. <laughs> Elemental is the next Disney Pixar film from uh, Peter Son, who is the director, and he actually was the voice of Socks in Lightyear. Um, Elemental, uh, I, they showed us a work in progress teaser, and it I teared up. I, I'm very sensitive. I feel like I cried everything. And the teaser was really good. It, it stars Wade and Ember, who's a water kind of Osmosis Jones, and then em Ember is a fire woman, and they clearly... Oh, I may have struck a chord here, but that's okay. But it looks really good because they're obviously two kind of elementals that can't be together because it's water and fire. And I'm like, oh, okay, this is definitely gonna, I'm definitely gonna pass the Pixar crying test or fail it. Joshua, what was your favorite? My favorite was the live action, live action Little Mermaid. We got to see the uh, entire performance of the song, Part of Your World, which, is, which just happens to be my favorite Disney song. So I was, you know, very skeptical going into it, but I thought she killed it. Yeah, I thought it was it amazing. Yes. It's such a classic song. Uh, she absolutely made it her own. It absolutely was, seemed like that was the peak, really, of the presentation. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, that was the highlight for me. And what about you? Uh, my favorite was the Haunted Mansion. Uh, I was really nervous going into it. I'm a fan of the ride, and it really captured a lot of what that ride, the kind of special, it's like spooky, but it's Disney, so it's friendly. Uh, they had some great cameos. Because you we, scare easy. Yeah. I, I scare very easy. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Winona Ryder. Dan uh, Levy. They teased Levy? Jared Leto Levy? as the hat box ghost. Can we edit in a little hat box ghost guy? <laughs> yeah. Yes, and Owen Wilson. He looks like the yeah. star of the show. Uh, Among well, other. He right. certainly he stole the show. Yeah. He stole the show. Everyone cheered for Owen Wilson. Yeah. yeah. Uh, of course, from Cars and Loki. Yeah. yeah, and then there was a great surprise on stage. I just got bodied yeah. by r 2 Honestly, that r 2 <laughs> said was like, F you. <laughs> the special surprise on stage is they had one of the actual carriages from the ride swing out mysteriously and spin around, revealing that Jamie Lee Curtis, the queen of horror herself, is going to be in Haunted Mansion. Doing what? We're not sure. But she was. She looked amazing. The crowd loved her. It and was it was a, a great answer. Yeah, yeah, it was great. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, I want to know what you are excited to see from this showcase. <laughs> Poster or a lithograph. Okay. Ball You're fired for this. Speaking. Yeah, obviously. Yeah, absolutely. What is your favorite? What did you like? Drop a comment and uh, We will read every single comment by the way. I will Especially Jeffrey. I will respond to every single one. I'm serious. That's a wrap. Great. Bye. <laughs> Absolute chaos. Great.